Hey guys, uh, welcome to another live video. Uh, I hope your day was uh, pretty amazing. Uh, mine was. I actually um, finished a lot of work and I also delivered my first bilingual workshop. Um, what it means is that I delivered it in Czech and in English as well. So I kind of said a few uh, sentences in Czech and then, uh, you know, I repeated them in English. It was very interesting. It was fun, but it was definitely quite, quite challenging. Um, so um, yeah, I'm actually looking uh, to uh, relax a little bit after after doing this live video. Um, today I want to talk about um, about intrinsic motivation and uh, how it's different uh, from extrinsic motivation and why is it so important um, to to have it to, to really motivate yourself intrinsically. Uh, so what does it mean? What is what is it? Intrinsic motivation. Well, intrinsic motivation is uh, something that drives us, and uh, it's actually our uh, driver. It's it's our motivator. It's something that uh, comes uh, you know from within us. Um, and by that I mean, um, for example the urge to help other people to make a world a better place, to learn new things, to um, succeed at something we really want and we consider uh, precious to us. So it's really this fire that's burning inside of us. So extrinsic motivation is something external. The most common extrinsic motivation motivator is money, right? Many people consider it uh, a huge motivator. Unfortunately, many people running companies consider it um, a huge motivator, but it's actually not true. Um, you know, money can be a great motivator up to a certain point, you know, but once they get, you know, off the table, um, intrinsic motivators are much more powerful. You know, money are good, but they lose their power very, very soon and very quickly. Another type of extrinsic motivator is, for example, um, you know, threat or, um, yeah, it, when someone when someone threatens you, uh, then that's extrinsic motivator as well. But uh, let's get back to intrinsic motivators because uh, well, they are more uh, precious. Um, so intrinsic motivators, or you know, the person who talks about intrinsic motivators uh, quite often is uh, Daniel Pink. He has an amazing TED talk, and I really, um, you know, I really uh, recommend you to watch it. And he talks there about these three main intrinsic motivators. You know, these three aspects that are crucial to our motivation, to our internal drive. You know, to what um, powers us. And these three are autonomy mastery and purpose you know if you have these three you don't have to be so afraid of burning out or running out of your drive so autonomy is uh, you know about uh, basically having a mandate you know having the ability um to do certain things on your own being at least partially independent or being a part of decision process, uh, being a part of decision process on things that are important to you, you know, kind of a, you know, holding the wheel. And it might not be just you holding the wheel, but, you know, just um, 
the feeling of uh, you know touching it at least with your with your finger and being at least partially master of your own work of your own decision of your own destiny so that's autonomy right um, mastery you know it's about being good in you know being good at something right it doesn't have to be something uh, you know high profile it doesn't have to be something um, too um, complicated but uh, you know being good at least at something it's very empowering you know it's another fuel for our in internal drive right so um, it's also very important to do something you believe you are good at and the third important thing when it comes to intrinsic motivation is um, purpose if you do something if you do it good if you can decide uh, about it if you can decide decide about yourself but you don't have any purpose you know your cause might be very much lost so this feeling of doing something meaningful this feeling of uh, being able to change things around you to help people to make the world a better place well, that's a pretty big deal and that's something that can decide if we feel motivated if we feel charged you know if we feel like we are on a mission or if we um, you know if we fail if we burn out uh, if we you know feel lost okay so uh, don't forget to check if you have your sense of autonomy mastery and purpose and um, yeah just uh, think about uh, what motivates you if these motivators are external uh, or if they are you know intrinsic and um, you know make sure that you have at least some some intrinsic motivators on your side that's you know how you how you get along okay so I wish you a very nice day thank you for watching it was uh, it was very nice and uh, yeah now I'll uh, have some rest see you soon guys bye